Hi you guys, my name is Daniel and today we're talking about the French film Mon Roi or My King as it's also known in English by French director Mai Wen. So this film actually brings us a very particular love story to the screen. What's the real conception of love? I think that's one of the, the questions that this uh, film raises. Is it find someone that you laugh with and that gets your humor? Or is it someone that you get a real connection with? Or is it someone that sticks with you even though you're going through a whole lot of trouble? Or is it that person that you live an excellent moment with? and that you know that things would really work out but somehow the timing doesn't seem right and somehow things just don't seem to work out for you is that love still? there are a lot of factors that may guarantee love and even then it's not sure that's even gonna happen and I think that's the kind of question that my Wayne, this French director raises in this particular film, My King starring Vincent Cassel and Manuel Berco this film actually shows us this couple who met and they just had a connection right away. They love with each other, they're spontaneous, they just seem to be right for each other. Everything seems to work out just right. But this perfect guy, this king that she has in her head, that she just builds uh, in her mind and in her heart, just turned out to be an opportunist. It's not that he wants to get something out of her, it's just that he wants to express his love when he wants it. And there is no coherence from what he says and what he does. And you feel sorry for them because when they met, they just seem to be like the perfect couple. And they're happy from the beginning, but things just start getting bad. They reach out a limit in their relationship where everything seems to be like bipolar. Everything seems to be filled with pain, with resentment, and only uh, the good and the bad memories that they've shared in the past. In parallel, we see actually how the protagonist, Tony, is trying to uh, recover from a knee injury. And that's uh, the recovery time when we get to see how she She's reminiscing about this love story and how she got to that moment in her life. I think the director does uh, such a great job in this film. Not only this couple is amazing, they have good chemistry on screen and, and you just feel how they live this relationship. You see how it turns out and you see the good parts and the bad parts and they just seem perfect uh, for a perfect fit for these both times. The director takes the time to explain the experiences and the time they've gone through the roller coaster emotions that they have uh, encountered and the unforgettable moments for the good and the bad reasons. So we get in the world of this couple and uh, the whole thing that they've gone through. For me, one of the best films, the love films that I've seen in uh, uh, recent months. And I really recommend it to you if you enjoy like broad stories about love, about couples, and this, the work of this director who, well, who seems to amaze me all the time. She gets a good balance of uh, love, but also nightmare. So there you guys have it. I really, really enjoyed it and I really recommend it to you if you like French film like this. I don't know if you guys saw it, let me know what you guys think about it and uh, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it and I hope you like the film also. If you like this video, remember to put some thumbs up and share it and I also invite you to subscribe to the channel where you can find some other reviews like this, French film, gay films, independent films, all of the films. Thank you so much for watching once again and I will see you next time. Bye!